Well, hello guys. Um, so I got another message today and I really do think it's coming um, either the 5th or the 6th just because on this message. So prayers for that, guys. Um, I'm excited. I'm actually going to go skiing this weekend. <laughs> Hopefully I don't get raptured out of the hill. <laughs> but okay. So my child, look at Israel's time. The moon will be at its fullest and you will be and you will hear a shout. Israel, Israel time, our time. Your fruits will be ripe, ready for harvest. Blessings for all. Trees bloom, leaves will be harvested. Look at the moon in Israel. It's a shift in the atmosphere. The anointing will see. Hear me look. I am calling you up. The tsunami will form. Destruction, chaos after missing children, missing people, heavens opened, heavens shake, my door will close, chosen ones reborn, hear them angels singing, heed these warnings, it's soon, look at the comet, it's green, high magnitude, the fig tree will wither, or sorry, high magnitudes, the fig tree will wither, now it's time to witness and share my teachings. Leviticus 2.8, you shall bring the grain offering that is made of these things to the Lord, and when it is presented to the priest, he shall bring it to the altar. Jeremiah 3.4, will you not from this time cry to me, my father? You are the guide of my youth. Colossians 1.7, as you also learned from Ephraphis, our dear fellow servant, who is a faithful minister of Christ on your behalf. Ezekiel 2.10, then he spread it before me, and there was writing on the inside and on the outside, and written on it were lamentations and mourning and woe. Then look at February 15th, day of completion. Fruits harvested. Keep looking at the moon, Israel time. Philippians 1.5, for your fellowship in the gospel from the first day until now. Acts 3.8, so he leaping up stood and walked and entered the temple with them, walking, leaping, and praising God. Matthew 11. Josiah begot Jeconiah and his brothers about this time they were carried away to Babylon. Matthew 3.14. And John tried to prevent him saying, I need to be baptized by you and are you coming to me? Genesis 2.3. The God blessed the seventh day and sanctified it because in it, he rested from all his work, which God had created and made. John 3, 5. Jesus answered, Most assuredly, I say to you, unless one is born of water and the Spirit, he cannot enter the kingdom of God. All right. Well, I got that message this morning. So um, I was praying over it and stuff just to get confirmation from the Lord. And he gave me some confirmation scriptures. So um, I'm going to pray again. Before I post it just because I'm paranoid but um guys it was I'm probably be gone this weekend just because I'm gonna be out of service um so if I ignore your comments maybe I'll see you in the clouds I don't know I guess we'll just have to wait and see all right god bless